This lesson is on interconnections, and the whole goal of this video is to explain what interconnections mean. So by the end of the video, I want you to be able to explain what interconnection means, and then start to give examples of how we connect it. So when we think of how we connected, there are many different reasons. Now, when I say connected, I don't mean um, family relations or just the people you're sitting next to. I'm talking about how we're related to one another in the area, um, in Australia, in New South Wales, and also around the world. So when we ask ourselves how we are connected, we're talking about how each individual human around the world is connected. And believe it or not, we are connected in so many different ways, it's unbelievable. The first one I'm gonna just give you a hint with is one that's really obvious, is tourism. Tourism is obviously when we go away on holiday and holidays can be within Australia, which we call domestic holidays, or holidays that we take um, in a different country and they're called foreign holidays. I just wanna to explain to you and give you an example of how we are connected using tourism. Well, first of all, there's a, there are so many different links. Um, and I'm just gonna take a part of what tourism um, all the different levels of tourism and show you how we're all interlinked. So when we talk about a vacation holiday, we think about going outside of Australia. That's really common. So first job, we've got the person who we go and book our um, holiday with. That's one person we're connected to. The second person, our, um, our driver who drives us from our house to the airport, someone else we're connected to. And at the airport where we're waiting, we're being checked in, We've met probably about four or five different people. And then those, those people will see pilot, um, steward, stewardesses, the people who uh, put our luggage on a plane, the people who run the airport, the people who are in control of the airplane when we're up in the sky, the radio operators. So there's a vast majority of people who we don't see, but we are connected to because of tourism. And then when we get to the holiday destination, We've got people who um, take us to different hotels. And then of course, when we get to the hotel, we've got people who work there. And then of course, we've got everyone else who helps us make sure our holiday is as enjoyable as possible. So when we're looking at how we're connected using um, tourism, just going on a simple holiday to Bali, we are connected with over 100, 200 different people. So in this unit of work, when we're asking ourselves how are people connected, tourism is one aspect that we're going to look at. So in the lesson, I want us to think about how else we are connected. Okay, that was your first lesson on interconnections.